The following video will show you how to cap and uncap sorbent tubes using a cap lock tool. Aside from during sampling and tube preparation, sorbent tubes should always be capped. Marks recommend brass or aluminium long-term storage caps for both short-term and long-term storage. The cap lock tool consists of two parts. The top is engraved with the Marks website address and the bottom is not. The bottom part of the tool has a deeper slot to house the bottom of the storage cap. Before using the cap lock tool, fit the long-term storage caps onto the tube, ensuring the tube passes through the PTFE ferrules within them. You should finger tighten the caps as securely as possible. To use the cap lock tool, first place the bottom of the tool, slot side up, between your thumb and forefinger. Then guide the cap tube into the slot. Hold the tube underneath the tool to provide better grip. You can then slide the top of the cap lock tool over the top of the storage cap. Quarter turn in a clockwise motion to secure the cap. Repeat the process to secure the second cap. To ensure cap tightness, grip the storage caps firmly and attempt to pull from the tube. Any caps that can be removed easily this way are not tight enough and should be retightened with the cap lock tool. To uncap sorbent tubes, follow the procedure in reverse order, quarter turning in an anti-clockwise motion. Be sure to grip your tubes properly to prevent dropping them. For more information, visit marks.com.